Making sure people have fun today means a lot of work for local businesses who bring those celebrations to life. Yeah, and our James Grow joins us live now from McBob's Pub and Grill on North Avenue with some information about the heritage and tradition that's tied to today. Good morning, James. Good morning, y'all. One of the things I want to talk about culture and heritage wise is this sport right behind me. It's called hurling. It's one of the biggest sports in Ireland. And actually the team here in Milwaukee is one of the biggest in the Midwest. So I'm with Corey here again. Can you tell me a little bit about hurling? Sure, it's one of the oldest sports in Ireland. Uh, it's very well attended, uh, very well played. I know this local club has gone to Ireland and played before. They've gone to Boston, they've been all over. Um, it's a great sport. They have people playing from six years old all the way to four years old. So, I mean, it's a great sport for everybody to learn. It's kind of a cross between soccer, uh, lacrosse, and uh, it's quite interesting. It really is. It's a great outfit. So when you mention soccer, it's, it's funny what, that we see this too because when I play soccer every Thursday, I see this hurling team practicing where I play my games. And I was like, oh, I, I don't know what that is. So, and I was like wanting to learn more because I thought these were interest, interesting clubs. I've learned now that they're called hurling sticks. Now, hurling. Uh, you ever play hurling? Uh, I have not. My, uh, I've gone to a couple of the games. My son has taken a little bit of interest and uh, I've tried it. It's not hard it, and it's definitely a workout. You're definitely running. And uh, What makes it so it. exciting? It is exciting. It's uh, you have a bunch of guys, you're running down, you have to actually balance it on the hurley, you have to balance it and once in a while, you have to pass, which is kind of the stick up and hit back. And uh, there's goals, there's all kinds of things. So it's, it's quite a fast paced game. And so when I see these, uh, all these different people practicing, there's like 40, 50 people on the field. It's pretty big here. And I feel like maybe a lot of people don't know about that in Milwaukee. No, I don't think they do. And it's a shame. I know the hurling club has tried to uh, promote as much as they can. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, they play, I believe, every Sunday, and they are at uh, MilwaukeeHurling.com, I believe is their website. And uh, they love to have everybody, because it's a great sport. It's really family-oriented. The guys, you know, people bring their grills, they cook out, they bring water. So I mean, it's, it's a lot of fun. It's more of a family event, and uh, it's quite, uh, quite large. Well, there you go. Now you know how to play hurling, if this is something that looks interesting to you. And I'm also going to tell you more about the preparations that they're doing for this bar because they've got a whole lot of people coming here live in Milwaukee. James Grow, TMJ4 News.